Johnny, obviously you guys as a team have had to battle some adversity all season. Was it almost fitting in a way that you guys had to come back from an early deficit to head to Supers for the first time since 2013? I'm sorry, I I couldn't hear the last part of that question. Could you repeat it? With, with all the adversity that this team has had to fight through all season, was it almost fitting that in the game that sent you guys to the Supers that you had to come back from an early deficit? Yeah, I think it does. Um, I mean, it's, it's just been a roller coaster all year. It's yeah, it's fitting that this is the same way. Next question is going to come from Alex Sawyer. Yeah, we talked to Austin Murr after yesterday's game, and he, he said that he looked up to you as a batter and he wanted to be like Johnny Butler. He kind of gets things going today. I mean, he goes three for six out of that leadoff spot and really sparks a couple rallies. Um, does that kind of go the other way? Do you kind of look at him and, and think you want to be a little like Austin Murr as a batter? Oh, of course. I mean, just the way he's able to control the zone and just fight and take his walks and – Hardly ever strikes out. I mean, he's just a great hitter, you know, and you try try to pick up on some of those things. Next question is going to come from Rob McLam. Yeah, Johnny, in the uh, first game against Louisiana Tech, I noticed the one you drove in the run on the infield hit, you busted it down the line. That kind of created some chaos. And then you almost had an infield hit. You kind of made it a bang-bang play when you grounded out to the shortstop. Uh, the effort stands out. What is it about you and about the NC State team where that effort that stands out to people like me really has become your norm? I mean, we just know if we play hard every single game, we're going to have, have a chance to win it, you know. And and all every single one of these guys, we all have speed. We can all create havoc on the base pass, and that's one of our strengths, and we know it. So we know we bust out everything and put pressure on people and cause them to make some mistakes. Alec, do we have another question from you? Yeah, I do. Yeah. Obviously, the regional um, part of this tournament for this program going back, you know, five or six years has been where it's ended. You obviously experienced that in 2019. Just what, what are the emotions like for you, for the whole team tonight to, you know, kind of bust through this year and get to advance to the Super Regionals? Oh, I mean, it feels great. It feels great right now, but uh... – you know, this isn't the end goal for us. You know, we we know we can, you know, we know how good we are and we know we can make it, you know, as far as anywhere. So, I mean, it's really relieving right now and satisfying, but um, we're not done yet and we're ready to go.